another lost lake. Just waiting to be discovered. Discovered, yes, but most importantly, fished. Two men and their fishing rods. We just rolled into the parking lot here at Colliery Dam. Um, when people think Colliery Dam, they think hook, line, bobber, oh, cast from shore. Cast from shore. That's our deal. Yeah, the routine there. But, but we got a boat. So, as you know, normally me and Nathan, we're, uh, we're two men on the fishing Yeah, house. we're two dudes. But uh, in true family fishing fashion. Whoa. Yeah, you hear family fishing fashion. That's good. We, uh, we brought along a third. Yeah. Here he is. Uh -huh. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> this is my boy Trevor. And uh, it's family fishing day here. So why not bring out the family? Bring out the family and catch some fish. fish. <laughs> there you go. Here we go. Here, Trev. Hold. Hold your rod, Trev. Hold it tight, though. Not out of the water. There you go. And you go just like that. Good job. Dip up! Dip up! <laughs> you didn't catch anything yet, eh, Trev? <laughs> so let you know what Trevor's running here. He's got a real nice apex. Some silvers and oranges. A little rooster tail on the end there. You think that's a nice one, Trev? Can you say apex? Okay. You nailed it. Enough for me. I'm sure Tyler's got an apex. I know I got an apex. I just I'm running straight silver today. Run straight silver. Straight silver. Is that effective? Okay, keep the line like this, okay? Out of the, 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 the water. Look like at this. Tyler. Look what he's doing. Up like that. Up like that, okay? There you go. Good job. So we're all rigged up and ready to go here. Um, Trevor's got his, uh, got his Toy Story. Got some Shakespeare. Uh, <laughs> big boy rod. Goes in the dark and floats. He's running Apex though, so that's oh. kind of a big deal. Yeah, and he cut it in the motor, so that's handy. <laughs> Just uh, what you run into when you're fishing with a two-year-old? You gotta have patience, so on family fishing. You gotta have patience. <laughs> <laughs> you have a, a unique way of doing things, my friend. So we're here on Colliery Dam. Now it's a 28-hectare park consisting of four lakes. Um, right now we're in the middle lake. And this lake and the lower lake are the two that are slated for removal. What that will do is um, naturalize the Chase River, enhancing the salmonoid habitat on the Chase River. Kind of cool. Just one side note there, Nathan. We take no sides. We're not yeah. here to mark a debate. Other than that, uh, I'm not going to say that there's easy boat access, <laughs> but there is, there is boat access. So you have a little bit of a trail, but yeah. no big deal. We'll just watch your, watch your footings. If no boat is available to you, there's a great bluff. I've seen countless number of people cast they can't count and that. catch fish. So uh, that's that's always a positive. Yeah. Um, obviously, catchable trout in. Well, not obvious, but there is catchable <laughs> trout in here. Apparently. <laughs> and if you do, if you are so lucky, uh, for a day. Is the limit? Yeah, there you go. And I don't I think it goes without saying. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned it or not. If you're gonna bring a motor, electric only. Yeah. We don't need nine nine two stroke. <laughs> Stick around in here. Yeah. All right, so it pretty much covers the dam rules. Yeah, they're pretty old, though. You know that? How old? They were built in 1910 to 1911. So that's like over 100 years old. Yeah, it's like it's like Tyler was born and then built them. Dads were built. <laughs> yeah, nice. That's a good brain, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Fine. <laughs> sometimes you like bananas, but sometimes you don't. Shit, eat shit. The fish can eat that now? That was very nice of you. You sharing? Very nice. Like father, like son over here with the rod in the water. Mama. Mama. A camera? <laughs> Yeah. You want your jam sandwich? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. 
a good tip. When you're fishing with a two-year-old, bring some snacks. Bring some snacks. Bring some snacks. The world's biggest sandwich for the world's smallest man. <laughs> there you go. Oh, say once, say it again. I do not like peanut butter and jam sandwiches. Why? That, they just don't mix well. There's no better mix. No, they just, they don't do it for me, man. They do not do it for me. Uh, so, take that or leave it. I'm leaving that. I don't want any piece of that. Uh, you keep eating it. Uh, I'm done. <laughs> All right. <get> <laughs> Another reason that uh, obviously we're out fishing with the fam is to promote Nanaimo's Family Fishing Day. It's actually it's British Columbia's. Is it British Columbia's Family, family Fishing Day? Fishing but, day. Okay. <laughs> well, we're going to celebrate it here in Nanaimo. <laughs> you can celebrate wherever you are. <laughs> and it's actually going to take place uh, on June 15th. There you go. 2013. 2013. At uh, Westwood Lake. Yeah. From 11 to 4. Pretty cool. I'm well, it is all day, but 11 to 4 people are going to be there. And what, what makes it extremely cool. These two guys are gonna be there. These two guys are gonna be there. So bring your fam, and uh, we got a booth set up. All the booth of all our ins and outs and do's and don'ts. And we can say hello. You can give us some tricks because we need some. <laughs> some tips for sure is handy. Yeah. <laughs> tips, tricks, and tips. Sure, you're a in that sandwich. Yeah. You want to show the camera? <laughs> 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 All right, so we made a few more passes here. We're just gonna try the old line drop session. Yep. Put the power bait while the swimming. You gonna put power bait on line? Yeah, it's all God, so it's like what I'll do too. You're welcome my power bait. It's in my tackle box. I guess it's. All right, well, we'll probably get no spat about this. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. We did go All right. Terry's pretty big on that idea, so. Yep. Say it once, say it again. Uh. No, I can't take that off. Yeah, that's gotta stay on trap. Safety first, right bud? <laughs> yeah, get that sneeze out of you. So, all set up now, I'm gonna do my bobber. A little bit of power bait on the end there. I'm gonna cast into the old Shady Grove. See what happens there. Best cast I've ever seen before. Thank you. Oh. You gonna have a go? Oh. Have a go. Oh. oh, you just threw my ball over board. <laughs> what did you do? You threw my bobber over. Oh, you can go get that. <laughs> so we're trying to uh, drop a line here, and it's getting a little windy, and we're kind of getting pushed around. We never bring an anchor. Yeah. Not, not a single time. We always said we should bring an anchor. <laughs> never have. So, being the, the two brainiacs we are, we came up with a genius idea. So we got the cord from the motor that goes to the battery. We found a stump coming out of the in the middle of the lake here. We just kind of tied it to the stump. <laughs> also, we always say we should bring rope. <laughs> Another thing we don't ever bring. So, until we bring those two things, we're, we're stuck tying our battery cables to the stumps. <laughs> you make do as much you can though. Anyway. So now we're gonna catch the fish. <laughs> I got a fish. 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 You hold it. Could I'll reel it. Yes. Here it comes. Trevi. Oh, no. oh. <laughs> That's what it's all about. You know? <laughs> I'd rather have him the opportunity than uh, <laughs> me to steal it. All right, well, we'll get the next one in, Trev. OK. All right, this is good. This is yeah. positive. We're headed in the right direction, anyway. Grab your rod. Grab your rod. Tip up. Tip up, Trevi. Tip up. Tip up. No, not throwing the phone. 
So, I don't know if you recall everybody's favorite uh, episode where Nathan lost his rod. Nathan did lose his rod uh, one episode. Still got his thankfully today. But the apple don't far, fall, fall far from the tree. Trim blasted his overboard pretty hard. It's not a pack to have floated, but, but it doesn't. Nay, nay. So if you're going to buy a Toy, or a Toy Story Toys R Us rod, it doesn't Remember, float. It doesn't float. Um, and if you catch one, 20 feet off of uh, Color Dam, man. <laughs> well, for all you fans out there that they're like, man, these guys got to show some fish. <laughs> Since we're not going to show any of our own, uh, we have promised in the past to show fan photos. So we'll roll them through. Yeah, we'll throw uh, a couple at you here. Who sends in their photos? We appreciate the fact the Facebook friends like no other. Yeah, absolutely. More the merrier. Yeah, keep them coming. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Well, we had a great day out here today on Colliery Dam. Um, unfortunately, bringing your two-year-old means he's got to go home and nap, so our day is getting cut short a little early here. But no worries. Yeah, Nathan had one on. Actually, he had two on. Yeah. Um, I'd say if we were out here a hair longer, we have we'd a couple. Definitely have one in the boat. But, but uh, that's how it goes. Get a little antsy here. <laughs> Must have his nap. It's all good. We had a great day. Weather was here. Yeah. Weather, uh, water was calm. Don't forget about Family Fishing Day up at Westwood Lake. We'll be there. We'll be there. We'll you'll be, be there. Square. But uh, until then, I'm Kyle Kyle. I'm Nathan Thomas. This is Trevor Thomas. Trevor. Look alive, buddy. <laughs> look alive. Oh, yep. Oh, oh. There you go. You say bye? Say bye. Bye. Nice. <laughs> We're two men in the fishing rods. I guess three men in the fishing rods today. <laughs> We'll see you next time. Thank you. For a more detailed map of our fishing locations, become a fan of ours on Facebook. That's right. Just look for two men and their fishing rods.